Hello there ladies and gentlemen, I'm back once more and in this episode we are going to go talk to Ranger Jackson or is it Ghost? I think it might be a Ghost. Ghost. You a courier? If so, this might be your lucky day. If you don't mind walking a bit and your eyes are good. Um, depends on the work. I think there's trouble in Nipton. No traffic from there on the roads. And while I can explain that away, the smoke from the town I can't. I'm sure it's been hit. What I need to know is if they survived it. Might be powder gangers with all that smoke in the air. If there's anybody left, they'd be in the Nipton Town Hall. Go there. Check it out. Let me know what you find. Um, if I pass through there, I'll check it out. Better than nothing, but close to it. Listen, I don't want you getting killed for this. So if you head there and run into trouble, I'm asking for eyes and ears. Not your life. All right? Anything? Yeah, never mind. I'll be going. Mind yourself on the plank going down. Uh-huh. Yeah, so let's go quickly. Let's take you and start walking. Why this guy's all the way down here? It's always weird that I find him down there. Mm -hmm. I started singing on Christmas tree. That was weird. Or not singing, humming. This is weird. Alright, so there's Nipton. Way out there. Now there's... This is... A, this this episode, I think I'm going to be a guy who's going to be aggressive and mean for... And, like, if you want something, he, I will take it. Probably by force. And I'll be a merc. More or less. Like, I'll do some things. Like, for free. Like, helping out Ranger Jackson was kind of a free thing. It's just kind of my habit. Alright. Now normally, you should be terrified if there's a red dot and it's something like that. But luckily for me, it's just a bunch of fans. In this case. Now I... I did upgrade this and I did buy a bunch of bullets for this gun. Now, th th normally I would cut this. And... Like, go cut and just go all the way over there and do it that way. But the road to Nipton is full of some dangers. Like, here, this is, a, as a starter gun, like for starters, this gun is a beast. Because you got, it's the first semi-automatic weapon. Like, the only things that are kind of better are your 9 millimeters. Whoa! Over here! Like, I think, mean, okay. those two. Normally you don't also start hearing gunfire from over here though. Oh dear. One sec guys. Sorry about that guys, I just had to quickly do something. Alright, so... This guy always wins, almost always wins the fight. So let's just immediately go into shooting. Whatever, I don't care. I want, I want his uh, bottle caps and his journal. All right. So the story is that those two kind of started out. They found out they really liked each other, and yeah, yeah, yada, yada, yada. Where's her corpse? Whatever. Like, um. So they were. Here it is. 
they were kind of in love and they were working together. But then it turns out, like, they started traveling the Badlands together. But then they learn, then she learned that he had a, he has a necklace made of bottle caps. And because of that, they ended up fighting. This is the fact that they are Sunset Sarsaparilla. They're, they're star bottle caps. Yes, they're the star caps. And back down we go. Because I have to raid all these guys for their loot. Yeah. So it should give me quite a bit of money. Uh, at least we'll get it. Pink. 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 Um. Jet, I guess, is worth it. As soon as it doesn't weigh anything. Next off, this person. And this one. And then... This one. Oh no, I'm over encumbered. I was actually waiting for that. Weapons. Repeaters. Let's make a bunch of super repeaters. Let's make a bunch of super pistols. could wear this, but I like having my high agility. Yeah, so the, the only issue with this gun is that you can burn through bullets so fast with it. That's the main issue. Alright, so yeah, as it turns out, this video will probably be a little bit shorter, just because I forgot to counteract my timer, so I might add maybe a minute onto this video. But probably not. Like, look at this armor looks real nice on my guy. Uh, his face doesn't look that nice, but everything else does. Hmm, that's not a good sign in any way at all. That's not good. Legion, Legion. These are the Legion bulls. Which was not a good thing. There we go. Yeah! Who won the lottery? I did! Smell that air! Couldn't you just drink it like booze? <laughs> <laughs> um... Are you feeling alright, sir? Are you kidding me? Never felt better! Yeah! Um, what sort of lottery did you win that would make you kind of go crazy? What lottery? Just a little crazy. The lottery! That's what lottery! Are you stupid? Only lottery that matters! Oh, oh my god, smell that air! <laughs> Are you a powder ganger by any Powder chance? ganger? What? I mean, yeah, used to be, sure. But not no more. Powder gang is small time, man. I'm a winner! I won the motherfucking lottery! <laughs> You're crazy, and I really need to get going. Bye. I always find that funny. Alright, and now, we promptly shoot him in the back. Like I said, my guy's not a nice person. I literally just killed him for the sake of killing him. Just because he won the lottery doesn't mean you should be that happy. I mean, like, honestly, what kind of lottery could you have won that would make you that happy? And you're a powder ganger, so I kind of killed you for that reason. Oh. Huh. This isn't good. That's one, two, three, four enemies, one dog. Four enemies and one dog. That's not a good Don't sign. worry. I won't have you lashed to a cross like the rest of these degenerates. It's useful that you happen by. I want you to witness the fate of the town of Nipton, to memorize every detail. And then, when you move on, I want you to teach everyone you meet the lesson that Kaisar's Legion taught here, especially any NCR troops you run across. 
What lessons did you teach here? Where to begin? That they are weak and we are strong? This much was known already. But the depth of their moral sickness, their dissolution, Nipton serves as the perfect object lesson. What exactly happened here? Nipton was a wicked place, debased and corrupt. It served all comers, so long as they paid. Profligate troops, powder gangers, men of the Legion, such as myself. The people here didn't care. It was a town of whores. For a pittance, the town agreed to lead those it had sheltered into a trap. Only when I sprang it did they realize they were caught inside it, too. Hmm. So you captured everyone with five guys. Yes, and herded them to the center of town. I told them their sins, the foremost being disloyalty. I told them that when legionaries are disloyal, some are punished, the others made to watch. And I announced the lottery. Each clutched his ticket, hoping it would set him free. Each did nothing, even when loved ones were dragged away to be killed. You slaughtered innocent civilians. Ha! <laughs> innocent? Hardly. Cowardly, though. They outnumbered us, yet not once did they try to resist. They stood and watched as their fellows were butchered, crucified, and burned. One by one, they stood and hoped their turn would not come. Each cared only for himself. Your crimes are quite unforgivable. As are all crimes. If you feel strongly about it, attack us, and soon you won't feel a thing. You know, I could attack them, but I'm not going to, because that would be dumb. They outnumber me by five to one. And those dogs aren't that hard to kill, but killing the legionaries is quite a bit harder, especially seeing as all of them have guns. Like, it's, it's kind of difficult. Anyways, um, my... <laughs> don't even know what I'm doing. No. So I'm coming in here to help out with this guy. Are you fucking kidding? First I get my legs smashed, and then in walks the powder ganger's grim fucking reaper. What the fuck have you got against us, man? Jesus fucking Christ! If you want me dead, just give me 15 medics and I'll fucking OD for you, okay? Fuck! Um, why are you still here? I don't know. I just love it here. What the fuck do you think, asshole? Prize for second place was I got to live. But they beat my fucking legs with hammers. I'm fucking crippled, get it? I don't have any medics for you, unfortunately. Bullshit! You're holding. You just want it all for yourself. Um, how did you survive? Luck, that's how. I'm just that fucking lucky. You're looking at the second place winner of the Nipton Lottery. That asshole Swanick took first place, so him they let walk. Tell me about the lottery. It ain't like we came to Nipton to play it. Me and my crew had it worked out to kidnap some NCR troopers who come to town to get laid. Had it all worked out with the scumbag mayor. We were going to ransom them off, keep their weapons for ourselves, a nice score. Uh, how'd your plan go wrong? We get in position. And next thing we know, we're surrounded by those fucking Legion freaks. They dragged us and everybody else into the center of town. And that asshole with a dog on his head, he starts talking about how we're bad people. He said we needed to be punished for what we did. Not all of us, but some of us. And then he gives everyone a fucking lottery ticket. Hmm. What happened after everyone got lottery tickets? What do you think? He started drawing tickets and that's how people got punished. First up was the lucky losers. They got decapitated. Guess that's lucky because it's pretty quick. Then came the crucifixions. God damn, but those went on and on and on. Third place runners up got enslaved. I got the fuck beat out of my legs and the winner, they let go free. So what happened to the mayor? Him? 
When his ticket came up, they burned him alive on a pile of tires. He said... He said some of the people of this town were enslaved? Yeah, a bunch of those Legion fucks dragged him off right away. They were headed east, if you're feeling heroic. I'll do what I can to save them. Don't act like you'd be doing me a favor. I don't give a fuck. I'm just doing it because I want to tick off the Legion, that's why. The Legion happened. What the fuck's it look like? Let's talk about something like else. Like what? Um, see you later. That's Bye. What. All right, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you in the next episode.